YouTube, how you doing today? Dolph Riddle here, bringing you the third update segment of the Minecraft NFL Stadium that we have been building. I haven't uploaded one of these in a while, but we have continued to build this stadium. And last time I did it, I think I remember these two grandstands had been done. If you haven't seen the part before this one, I'll put the link in the like the first link in the description of this video. So if you want to check that out before this one, then go do that. But on to the tour. So as you can see now, we have this interactive glass waterfall on one of the sides of the stadium so it can overlook the whole stadium. To get to it, as you know, these grandstands are all completely interactive. You can walk underneath all of them. They're gonna be completely decked out with food stands and absolutely everything. We haven't gotten to that bit yet, but all of these grandstands are fully built on the inside. So just like a like regular stadium, we have built this like an exact stadium inside and out, not just for the visual look, but for the actual, like using it as well. We want it to be exactly the same. We're not fucking around with this. This is fully serious. So you can see here through the waterfall, the glass waterfall, you can see the NFL saying it's more just for looks, but we did have a walkway through there. So you could walk into the other grandstand. Like I said, fully interactive. If you're in here, you can go straight out here and look onto the thing. If this is where your seats are, you can walk up to those seats up there, or you can come up those, like obviously this bit down here, you can go to the lower level, which will have more food stands and stuff like that. I haven't fully done the uh, carpet and shit in here yet, but this will have it fully carpeted, fully lightened. So you can go down there. And like I said, all these staircases either lead up back to the seats or down into that under uh, little level below this one. We have stairs up here that go to the top of the grandstand level. And just remember, every grandstand is built pretty much exactly the same as this. So all the work we've done on this grandstand, all the others are pretty much identical. So if we go out this little steps up here, this is the stairs for the top floor. So if you get not as good seats, but you still get a pretty good view from the ground from up here. The big NFL logo in the middle, it took fucking ages to fucking make. So that's the top seating up here. But if you're really rich and you will, you know, buy some pretty decent tickets, you want to go into our, what I like to call our VIP boxes, then you can just go straight over here, open up your little door. So there's all these little doors made, all exactly the same. You can open up all of them. Go down here in your little VIP box. There'll be another door that you have to go through in case like people try and steal your box. And here's your red velvet carpeted VIP room. Glass so you can watch the game. Or you can go out onto your fucking balcony, which we've also made, and watch the game from here. With all the people, the atmosphere, you can watch the whole NFL game from out here. It's fucking sick. And like I said, this grandstand over here is exactly the same as that one over there. It's been completely built to replica. This one has two staircases. The other one will eventually have two staircases as well, but they take a long time to make. But completely interactive. All these boxes are exactly the same. Red velvet carpet. They'll all have stuff in them, hopefully furniture and shit like that. Like I said, this one over here, pretty much exactly the same. The scaling is just slightly nice. With that one, that box over there, you know, you pay a little bit cheaper. It's a little bit smaller. But, you know, we couldn't uh, quite make it as big because it's not as long, as long as the grandstand. But there's our waterfall from above. Hopefully none of the water leaks out because that would be very bad if the field got nice and wet. <coughs> but, as you can see over here, we've started building the player race where players will be running out of so the fans can watch their favorite team. So if we go through here, you can see this is probably going to end up being a little bit smaller because at the moment it's fucking massive. It's a very large player race, but this is where the players will run out of. They've got their own little walkway, and this goes into the bottom level of this grandstand. This will be all sectioned off, hopefully, so that this is an actual player room. Hopefully we can get some couches and shooting here for players to relax and stuff like that. So this will be the player room. It'll be all nice and light where they run out here. I'll fucking carpet all this shit for them. And then they can run out here, run onto the field, and get cheered by every single person in all of these grandstands. How fucking big does it look? Obviously, that's not done over there yet, but it will be. And this, honestly, has taken us a fucking lot of time. This grandstand is the last one that we have to actually finish and complete, because it's not done like the rest of them yet. But this has taken us a very, very, very long time. There's even parts underneath the stadium we've built underneath the actual stadium floor. So if you went down, I think it was the other way... If you went down this side of the stadium, you can actually go and have like a nap and shit. These are like our locker rooms where players are like, maybe this is like a first aid room or something like that. I don't know. We just built under here just for the shits and gigs of it because, you know, you know, it gets very repetitive building grandstands over and over again. But seriously, guys, we have spent probably collectively 260 hours between me and the two other people that have been helping me do this. And honestly, so much respect to those guys. They put in a lot of effort to help me do this because honestly, I want this to be the greatest NFL stadium that is on YouTube because every other NFL stadium 
it, they're not practical. They're just the outside. It's purely for visuals. But this, with the grandstands that you can walk in, everything like that, it's going to be 100 percent interactive you can walk through the stadium you can go get food it's a hundred percent we'll build the insides of the grandstands the roof we're going to build the outside the car park everything that's how detailed we want this fucking nfl stage we want it to be the greatest nfl minecraft built stadium ever on youtube so if you know someone that likes minecraft and you enjoy this video please send the link to this video let's try and get a lot of views in this video because i really really can't I can't fathom how much work we put into this. It's fucking ridiculous how much time and effort we put into it. So if you do enjoy it, please smash the like button. It would put a massive smile on my face. And if you are new around here, please be sure to subscribe for all the content from Minecraft, Call of Duty, and everything I do. I play a lot of video games. So please be sure to subscribe. But as always, guys, this was Dolph Riddle. Have one last look at the NFL stadium. It's beautiful. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video.